hello friends welcome back again today in this video we are going to solve this algebraic expression and the given expression here is 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x that is equal to square root of 6 powered by x minus 9 power by x then we'll solve these equations for the real values of x so friend if still you have not subscribed my channel please do subscribe the channel and do not forget to hit the like icon now let's start the video now if you look at here 2 and it is multiplied of 2 and 3 and it is the square of 3 so for simplifying this equation first of all we'll remove this square for that we'll have to square both the sides so let's start with this so we will square 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x will square it and in the right hand side also square root 6 powered by x minus 9 powered by x and will square it so here square and square roots gets cancelled so we can write it as 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x that is square equal to 6 powered by x minus 9 powered by x so here the next step we will write it as 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x that is whole square and here the value of 6 we can write 2 times 3 that is powered by x just we have separated in its factor and here the 9 we can write it as 3 times 3 and powered by x so that we can take 3 powered by x common from both the sides now we'll separate the power value and we'll write it as here left hand side we'll write as it is 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x whole square and here we will separate the power means 2 powered by x times 3 powered by x according to power rule we can write this so here minus 3 powered by x times 3 powered by x so in the left hand side we will write as it is 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x that is whole square so now if you look at carefully in the right hand side of the equations we have 3 powered by x common so we will take 3 powered by x common 3 powered by x so in the bracket the remaining will be 2 powered by x here 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x here 3 powered by x so now we'll take everything in the left hand side we'll take this term in the left hand side and it will be 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x square minus 3 powered by x we have taken this term in the left hand side so it will be negative 3 powered by x in the bracket 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x bracket close that is equal to 0 now now from here we can take again 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x common so we'll take 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x common and remaining here 1 2 powered by x and 3 powered by x remains so we'll write 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x and here minus 3 powered by x so we have taken 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x common so this is the value in the left hand side that is equal to 0 now we'll write it here and it is 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x in one bracket in another bracket we'll simplify it it will be 2 powered by x 2 powered by x minus here 3 powered by x and negative 3 powered by x is negative 2 times 3 powered by x that is equal to 0 so here the multiplication of two values are 0 so either the first value will be 0 or the second so we'll write 2 powered by x minus 3 powered by x equal to 0 or 2 powered by x minus 2 times 3 powered by x is equal to 0 now we'll simplify it it is we'll take this 3 powered by x in the right hand side so 2 powered by x that is equal to negative value will be positive 3 powered by x now we'll divide both side by 3 powered by x that will be 2 powered by x divided by 3 powered by x that is equal to 1 so here we can write it as 2 by 3 whole powered by x here according to law of indices we have written 2 by 3 powered by x that is equal to so the value of 1 in terms of 2 by 3 we can write 2 by 3 and power 0 any power 0 is 1 so here we have taken 2 by 3 in terms so that the base value remains same in the both hand side so according to law of indices we can write x is equal to 0 so we have one solution x is equal to 0 now we'll solve this this is 2 powered by x we'll take this term in the right hand side it will be 2 times 3 powered by x so therefore 
टू पॉड बाय एक्स दैट इज डिवाइडेड बाय थ्री पॉड बाय एक्स इज इक्वल टू टू सो लाइक वाइज ही अगेन विल राइट टू बाई थ्री पॉड बाय x that is equal to 2 now our solution of x will take log both side with base 2 by 3 so we'll take log 2 by 3 base and here 2 by 3 powered by x that is equal to we'll take log 2 by 3 and 2 so here the value of x will be here 2 by 3 and 2 by 3 is 1 so value of x will be log base 2 by 3 and 2 so this is another value of x here so we have calculated two values of x that is equal to 0 and here log base 2 by 3 and 2 so friend these are the method to solving this type of problem first of all we will simplify the equations then after that we will simplify it in the form of x so that we can calculate the value in terms of law of indices and after that we take log so that we can calculate the value of x in terms of log so friend if still you have not subscribed the channel please do subscribe the channel thank you for watching the video